Hello everyone and welcome to your tutorial on how to get to the Miller Wells presentation and quizzes that have been assigned to you recently. Okay, first thing you want to do is make sure that you can get into your Google Classroom. If you need the code, I have provided it for you. And if you do not remember it or have lost it, you'll need to talk to me in person so that way I can give you the code. Okay. Now, assuming I got into the Google Classroom, your desktop is probably going to look a lot different than mine because, well, obviously mine are all welding classes. Now, let's just, for this uh, example, say that I am a welding one student in class period 10B. Okay, so first I'm going to locate my class period and select it. Now, what I want to do is go over to the classwork And you will see these tabs here. You're looking for the Miller Weld's presentation and quizzes. Now you're going to want to follow the instructions that are listed below. So you're going to follow this link, which I'm not going to click on just yet because I want to get through reading the instructions to you. Next, select the tab Metal Cutting Plasma Oxyfuel. Then follow the presentations and take the quizzes for the four modules, process explanation, equipment, torch and consumables, and arc starting and cutting techniques. Make sure you enter your full name and school name as in example one. Here is example one. This is where you would put in your name and your school name. Okay, you must get 100% on the quiz and your name must be present, uh, or excuse me, your name must be printed on the paper to receive any credit for this assignment. You may take the quiz as many times as needed to get 100%. After you have received 100%, print out the page with a certificate, as in example two, and turn it into me. Here is example two of what the uh, certificate should look like, minus the words that say example two. See how <laughs> for this I used example for the name in Page High School. Now, let's take a look a little deeper into this. So click on the extension. It may take a moment to load up, so please be patient. Okay, so now that we have the page loaded up, you're going to want to scroll down to where it says Metal Cutting Plasma Oxyfuel. Click on it, and here you will see the first presentation, Process Explanation. You're going to want to click on the presentation. Okay, so you're going to go through the presentation. Keep in mind that you might need headphones for some of these because there are videos and various uh, presentations that you'll need to listen to. So, to go through it, you'll just need to click next, read through what it's asking you, and so on and so forth. Okay, so once we're done with the presentation, you're going to want to click on the quiz. If you get this message, that means you've probably taken this quiz before, but if you didn't get 100% on it and you need to take it again, just hit no. Now, you're going to enter your full name. For me, I'm just going to put Mr. Rangel. And then school name. Okay, then you're going to click next and go through the questions that are, an are asked in the quiz and answer them correctly. Once you're finished, you should get a certificate that looks like this. All right. So, 
you should be able to print this out and hand it in to me. If you do not know how to print, I will go over that right now. You're going to look towards the top of your browser if you're using Google Chrome for this icon here. Click on it. You're going to look where it says print. Keep in mind you can also hit control P, but let's do it this way. Okay, now that I've selected print, it's going to show me a preview of what I'm about to print. See how it has my name on it and the high school? Okay. So, now, if you're doing this in the library, it should automatically have the library printer selected. But, because I'm not doing this in the library, and I don't have a printer hooked up to this particular computer, uh, I'm going to do it a little, little differently. But, uh, if where it says here, uh, save as PDF, it says uh, high school or HS library, then you would just hit the blue button. For that, it should say print. Print it out and bring it to me. If for any reason you cannot print it, go ahead and click on here, hit save as PDF, go down and hit save, will most likely take you to a, a window that says downloads and then you're going to save it cutting processes quiz one should automatically come up as that hit save okay now what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to go into your email uh, attach it in an email to me and send it to me that way. Okay. So hopefully that answers any questions that you have. But if you have any uh, questions that this video did not answer, please go to the stream in your Google Classroom and type it in the class stream. So that way, if uh, another student in the class has the same question, it will be answered there. I will do my best to answer your questions as quickly as possible. Alright, that wraps it up for this video. Thank you and best of luck on your quizzes.